Hey again guys, this is Feeder, and with a little help from Switcher Saw on Reddit, the Dota 2 subreddit, I've gone through and checked which items have custom effects, and I'm just previewing all the items here and any effects that they may have. Let's see, Elixir of Dragon's Breath for Brewmaster has a sweet particle effect, and I think it changes this a little bit. Just gonna zoom in to get a better look at that. That is ridiculous. Also, when he spawns, he drinks out of his cask, so it looks like he's just drinking fire, which is pretty wicked. Thirty seconds. This is the flourishing lodestar for With Enchantress, grace. which is super shiny. It looks like it's glowing. I this think it's supposed us. to have an effect here, and instead we are not seeing anything, time. so that is bugged, and hopefully it will be fixed soon. This is the White Sentry of Crystal Maiden, and doesn't have an effect that I've noticed, so I'll just zoom in and look at it. Faster. Looks like a ward. For those of you ward freaks out there, this is like the staff for you. Forward. This is the Crystal Dryad for Tiny, and I did want to try it on him Forward. in all sizes. This one looks ridiculously big for him. He can grow into it a little bit. The game is on. Okay, he looks a little more reasonable at this size. For him to be carrying that. And back Nobody to likes how to you'd be seeing it in game. Yet everybody likes to win. This is the soul diffuser for Spectre. And as far as I can tell, I don't think it does anything. Um, except look really, really good. It's very shiny. Thirty seconds it's really to go. bright. This is the Blade of Tears for Morphling. So it gives him these kind of, I think, goofy looking uh, things there on his arms. They're so stiff and his model is so fluid, but um, I think. Can I do this? I think the attack animation is the same. The adaptive strike is definitely different. That looks really cool. And I think the Ethereal Blade. I'm not sure if the E Blade uh, animation is different. Anyway, they're, um, I guess, an ethereal blade for each arm, and they look really wacky while he's moving around, but, uh, neat effect. Okay, this is the Swift Claw um, Blink Dagger for Ursa, and gives him, like, a nice blue swipe on his auto attack. It's very cute. 30 seconds to go. Who calls me? Those blink daggers, though, That's amazing. <laughs> These are splattering force appeals, and I have no Kelly. idea if I said that right, but they are the plague wards for Venomancer. They look like some alien mm. bug. It's like a StarCraft thing. I don't do StarCraft, but I've seen it enough to feel Die like that looks familiar. Thirty seconds to go. Anyway, they're super sweet. <laughs> This is Kunkka's Inverse Bayonet, and uh, let's take a quick preview look at it here. It's pretty neat. It's super shiny when Tidebringer is up, but I think By the real uh, excitement is the gun animation for that. So that's it's pretty epic. This is the Inscribed Manius Mask for Drow Ranger. Go ahead and... Uh, Zoom in on the showcase view so you guys can see the difference between the idle animation for the regular drow model and the drow that is wearing this mask. Uh, it's a little bit, um, it's a little bit weird. I think that's on purpose, but it looks quite different. Um, there's also a custom effect with the Mask of Menace, so when I pop that, you'll get that nice little red flash there that I don't think um, you get generally on that here. From above, it looks pretty good. And still get a really good sense of that animation, yeah. and um, your mid tower you want to build a mask of madness every time. Oh, mother! Hey, these are the geodesic eidolons for Enigma. See, they have a pretty gorgeous animation. Look like they're swimming slash floating through the air. Very, very different from the normal model, but uh, Acceleration. pretty epic actually. Like this. 
Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and hopefully I'll be seeing you soon from TI4. Yes! Um, and I know some of you are probably asking, where's the giveaway feeder? I didn't get a courier, so I'm not going to do that. But I hear I'll be getting things at TI4, so keep your eyes open and be patient. Alright, best to all of you, and good night.